That's it. I've had enough and I'm finally getting the truth. Rebecca, what are you doing? I'm doing what I have to do. Oh, no. <laughs> Rebecca, what are you doing? That's what you get for talking to another girl. I wasn't talking to another girl. Oh, really? The girl with the dark hair? Rebecca, what are you talking about? Oh, really? Maddie? What? Maddie? Was he talking to another girl? Matt? No, no, he wasn't. Are you serious? You are on the group chat. I saw your name too. I don't know what you're talking about. Matt was not talking to another girl. That's it. You're lying. You're lying. I'm done. Maddie? Yeah? job. Yes! Thank you for lying to my wife. Now I know I can trust you, but you need to do a lot better if we're gonna get Rick Noah back here. We have to get really good at lying to get my best friend back here. <gasps> but we're gonna start this off with seeing Maddie's real hair. Hair reveal! Hair reveal! Hair reveal! Hair reveal. Hair reveal. See, you guys know Maddie got her hair cut and it's short and finally we get to see what it looks like. Are you ready? Okay. Ready to reveal to this amp fam? Three, two, two one! because you guys finally get to see Maddie's new hair. Do you think it's cute? You guys comment below. I think it's so cute. Oh, so short, you. Maddie. That's but different. in a good way, you look good. It looks really good. Who would think that a fail by me would turn into this? It's just perfect. Good thing we had a professional. Okay, yeah. to the leaderboard. Come on. This is the leaderboard right here. We are gonna see who can lie the best. Maddie, I can trust you. You can lie to my wife. That was mm -hmm. actually great. How did she lie to your wife? I Rebecca. never lied. Yeah, she lied. About what? Okay, let's just move on, okay? Nice shot, Maddie. Get one check. Woo, one for Maddie. What did she lie about? Uh, nothing, nothing at all. So is that his crush? Girl, he's sexy. Get over it right now, okay? What we're doing right now is to see who is the best at lying so that we can lie to Rick Noah to get him back here because he doesn't want to talk to us, but we need him bad. Matt, before we start, I just want to say I'm really sorry about throwing the water on you. Rebecca, you're not going to get any check marks right now. You're not going to get a check marks. Come on! Lie. I saw right through it. I saw right through it, okay? All right, Maddie, you have the first check mark. The first of three wins because we need to figure out some really Really good lies to get Rick Noah to come back here, and whoever is the best at lying is gonna be the one that delivers that message to Why him. do we have to lie to Rick Noah? Well, you saw what happened yesterday thanks to you guys. He doesn't trust any of us. Actually, Matt, it's your fault for not telling us earlier that Rick Noah loves Disneyland because that's where his parents took him before they got divorced, and it's closed. It's his birthday on Saturday, okay? So we have to really get this going. Daniel said that we need a puzzle master to unlock that iPhone so we can find RZ twins. Looks like there's some type of puzzle to get into it. The only person that is a puzzle master here is Rick Noah, so we really need his help, except for the fact he hates us. I know, I know. So let's practice on getting some really good lies going. Whoever is the best wins. Let's start lying. I don't know about this. Do you think lying is necessary? Shouldn't we just focus on doing something for his birthday? I mean, true. Wait, where are you going, Maddie? Oh, to my old room. For what? I left something in there that one night that I spent the night. Oh. Is it cool if I go grab it? Oh, yeah. I was just gonna check on Peanut. Peanut! Hey, Peanut. Just wanna make sure you're okay. Okay, ZamFam, I know there are those videos where it's like, will my friend lie to my best friend? But I don't know if that's the smartest idea. We need Rick Noah here, and obviously his feelings are hurt. But what if we just focus on setting up a giant surprise birthday party for him. I think that might be a better idea than this. I just don't feel right about lying. What do you think, Peanut? Okay, yeah, I'll put you back. Hey, Matt. Hey, Maddie. Uh, have you seen my Hydro Flask? Uh, what's a Hydro Flask? It's like my pink water bottle. It has stickers on it. I don't know, I'm just like really thirsty. Pink water bottle and stickers? No, I haven't seen it. Okay. You must be thirsty. Is this it? Yeah, you're oh, Thank you. Oh, oh, you are welcome. That's a hydro flask? Yeah. Okay, you guys, so listen, I was thinking about this whole line thing for Rick Noah, and I was like, his birthday's coming up. What? <gasps> Why is there pickle juice in my hydro flask, Matt? Do you put pickle juice in there? You no, know, I just learned what that was. It wasn't me. Then who put pickle juice in my hydro flask? You know I hate pickles. <coughs> That's a terrible person, whoever did that. Oh my gosh, it burned. Really? Mm hmm. Must have been like more than just pickles. Okay, I need to rinse my mouth out. Is that you, Matt? That's one for Matt. Yep. Really? For a check mark? Matt, I was thinking about this whole line thing. I don't think it's necessary. What if we plan a surprise birthday? I mean, I don't know exactly what the birthday would be. But what if we do no, that? No, 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 Rebecca, if I know my best friend, he wants me to lie to him, okay? I have to lie to him to get him here. That's how it works. I'm gonna go put a one by my name. Check, check, check. I don't know, you guys. Should I just call Rick Noah, apologize? Maybe he'll come here? Or should we do something for his birthday? Otherwise, I gotta figure out a way to lie. Because I am losing on this leaderboard and I hate losing. Yes, yes, yes. I'm a liar. Liar pants. I'm a lion. Lion dance. I, hold on. Maddie has two check marks? That's not right. How does she get another check mark? Uh, Maddie, Rebecca? Okay, I obviously got a check mark. Maddie had one, but now she has two? Are you kidding me? Uh, yeah, because I'm the best liar. What? What did she lie about? Did I miss something upstairs? Okay, I am not comfortable with this whole lying challenge, okay? 
okay? So I'm, what are you doing? I'm just thinking about this song I have. Ready? I'm a liar, liar pants, doing the lion, lion dance. They call me lion because I'm lying all the time. Are you lying all the time? <sighs> are you lying all the time, Matt? No, I'm not lying all the time. What are you talking about? Okay, Where'd listen. Where'd you get that? Listen, you know what? I don't have any check marks because I don't feel comfortable with this lion challenge. I mean, Matt, have you even tried to call Rick Noah? He's your best friend. Couldn't you just reach out, tell him what happened, explain to him that we didn't know the situation, and then he'll come over? Can we just like trick him and like lie to him to get Matt, him? can you call him? Okay, just call him. Yes, yes, I'll call him. Okay. Okay, fine. Yeah. Just call up best friend. Dial number six. Oh man, Matt's calling me. This guy, after yesterday, gave me terrible advice, telling me to be mean to the girls because that's what family does. That's not what family does. They don't tear you apart, they build you up. But he is my best friend and he's probably worried about me. Hello? Hey, Rick Noah. I've been better, you know. What are you doing? Do you want to hang? No, I, I, I can't come over today. I'm just still feeling really sad and out of it, and I just don't want to be a burden, and I'm still really upset about yesterday. Are you sure? No, Matt, I, I can't come over. Uh, I, I gotta go. I, I gotta go. I, 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 okay, bye. I don't know, man. It doesn't feel right. Calling me and acting like nothing's wrong, and yesterday really hurt my feelings with my birthday around the corner. You know, I got feelings, and the Zam fam hurt every single one of them. What? I told you guys, he doesn't want to hang out. I need to lie to get him here. You didn't uh, even try. Okay. Okay, listen, listen. Let's say he gets over here. Once he finds out that the only reason we're trying to get him over here is to do the puzzle so we can open the phone, don't you think he's gonna get even more upset? He'll be fine. You know what? I'm gonna FaceTime Rick Noah and I will be lying. Good luck with that. Okay, same thing. I'm gonna FaceTime Rick Noah and lie to him and tell him that I'm at my apartment and see if he will come hang out. FaceTime from Maddie? Maddie never calls me. Uh, I wonder what it is. Um, do you think that he's gonna answer? Is he ignoring my FaceTime? Maddie? Oh, hey Rick Noah, how are you? I don't think you've ever FaceTimed me. Where are you? What are you doing? Well, I'm actually at my apartment. Awesome, I love the view. Can you show me the view? Oh, um, I can't really move my phone hmm. right now. You can see my apartment in person. I don't know if I can come over. <gasps> Wait, what was that noise? Um, oh, I was practicing my barking. Roof. So, um, what do you say? Come over to my apartment? You know what, Maddie? I gotta go. I'm not feeling too well. Uh, I'll, I'll talk to you later. Are you sure? <sighs> Zane Fam was so close, but then Blackjack ruined it and he barked. <sighs> Weird. First Matt calls me, and then Maddie is trying to FaceTime me. She never does that. I mean, maybe they are just trying to be good friends. They both called to check up on me, and they said no to each of them. And you know what? That's not what friends do. I need to do a better job and set the example. Maybe I can get them a package or go get them something, but I don't know. Okay, Zan fam, nothing's working right now with Rick Noah. That phone call that Rebecca and Maddie did to Rick Noah with the voicemail from Disneyland kind of got me thinking maybe I can trick him into coming here by mentioning some of his favorite things. So let's start out with... A giveaway. Let me just block my number. Hi, Rick Noah. This is Jimmy Beans calling from Broccoli and Asparagus Land. I am calling to let you know that you just want a year supply of green vegetables. All you need to do is go to Matt and Rebecca's house. I'll be waiting there for you. I have a large truck. Hung up. Okay, that didn't work. Pretty sure he probably thought it was like a prank call or something like that. So I have to like hit more at the heartstrings. What does he like? Well, he told me this one time. He loves ball pit balls. So I'm thinking, what if it's just nothing but green ball pit balls? Hello, this is Nathan from the ball pit ball place. Yes, we're actually discontinuing all of the green ball pit balls. And I was watching a Matt and Rebecca video and it looked like you're a big fan of the green ball pit balls. So we just want to go ahead and give them all to you. Do you mind taking that? Yeah, it's about, um, I'd probably say about 10,000. Enough to fill the pool. Yes, you can fill the pool with that. <sighs> I shouldn't have mentioned the pool. It's Rick Noah's biggest fear. Why would I say pool? What was I thinking? Okay, uh, what else can we do? What else can we do? Oh, you know what? St. Patrick's Day is coming up. St. Patrick's Day! I have a really good idea. Okay. Hi, matey! This is the luck of the Irish! Yes, you just won a pot of gold! Uh, for St. Patrick's Day! We're more interested in lucky charms these days! We want to give you the pot of gold! All you need to do is just go to Matt and Rebecca's house and collect your pot. That's the end of the ring. Uh. I thought those were gonna work. A pot of gold, he's not interested in. He doesn't want a year supply of green vegetables, mainly asparagus and broccoli, and a bunch of ball pit balls. Oh, actually, I did a terrible job at delivering all those. What are all these phone calls? They're all coming from the same number. Wait, that's Matt's number. That's weird. Let me just give him a call. I mean, this has to be a mistake, right? Wait a second, hold on. Rick knows calling me back. Did I not block my phone number? Oh no, oh no. Hey Matt? Hello? I just got these weird phone calls. One about broccoli and ball pit balls and then one for St. Patrick's Day. Is this you? Cause I just dialed the number and it called you. <coughs> 
that. Sorry, sorry. Let me mute. What do I do? I can't lie to him. I cannot lie to my best friend right now. He sounds terrible. I mean, I mean, you don't sound too good. Yeah, sorry. I uh, just got a little bit sick and I got bored and I thought I'd give you a call. You're sick? A little bit of cold, maybe? I don't know what it is. Oh, that's that's no good. Um. Yeah, sorry, man. I didn't mean to bother you. I'll let you go, okay? I'm fine. I need to get back to this competition, okay? This challenge and then to get some sleep. I'll talk to you later. All right, bye. Bye. I panicked at the end. What was that? I, uh, let me go talk to the girls right now. We need to rethink everything right now. I think we're doing this whole thing wrong. We can't lie to my best friend. Oh, Daniel's calling me. Hold on. Hey, Daniel, what's up? Matt, are you guys expecting some sort of special package? Oh, yeah. Actually, we are. I need to follow up on that. Tracking. Wait, how did you know about that? Yeah, I've just been doing some security protocols around the house, and I saw that you guys were expecting something. Just making sure it didn't okay. arrive, but I gotta go. Okay, take care. Bye. All right. Thanks, Daniel. That was weird. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad. My friends are trying to reach out and now I found out my best friend is sick and I've been ignoring him all day. Man, I feel really bad, but I gotta make it up to him. <sighs> what can I do? Maybe I can call Matt's mom and she can give me some recommendations of what I can get at the store for him to make him feel better. That way, Rick, putting the pieces together, solve another puzzle, Rick Noah. Let me get Matt's mom's number. All right, perfect. I was able to get Matt's mom's number. All right, Rick, be polite, be yourself, make a great first impression. You only get to meet your best friend's mom once. Here we go. Ringing. Hello, how are you, Mrs. Slays? Hey, Noah. It's me, yes. Hey, how are you? I'm really good, thank you. How are you today? I am doing great. I just had a couple quick questions I wanted to ask you. Okay. Well, Matt says he's not feeling good. He's just been, you know, not feeling great at all, actually. And I'm trying to figure okay. out a get well package I can put together of some of his favorite items. Oh, okay. He really likes nut chocolate chip ice cream. He likes music. Yes, music. He likes brownies with peppermint patties in the middle. Ooh. He if it was me, I would probably make him some chicken and a little food because mm. I think that that would be the best thing for him if he's not feeling well today. That sounds great, actually. I usually do online shopping, but I think I can pull oh, this okay. together. How does okay. Mountain Dew do with him? Does Mountain Dew settle his stomach at all or Twinkies or anything like that? Maybe he would like that. I don't know about Twinkies, but he might like Mountain Dew. Perfect. Well, I really appreciate all your help today, and you've been so helpful, and it's so nice to meet you. He's told me so many great things about you. Well, he's told me so many great things about you as well. Really? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I loved your glasses, by the way. Thank you so much. I love yours. Oh, thanks. It's not every day you get to meet your best friend's mom, so thank you so much for your help, and I really appreciate you. Well, I really enjoyed meeting you today as well, and I sure hope Matthew feels better. You'll have to keep us posted. Okay, I definitely will. Well, I'll talk to you soon, okay? All right, bye. Bye. Yes, that was the best. Mrs. Slay for the win. She gives great ideas, but I don't think I can get chicken noodle soup at the store. But hopefully, I can find music, a drink of his choice, probably Mountain Dew. She wasn't sure about the Twinkies, but uh, where can I go, though? You know what? CVS. Yes, that's got to be it. When Matt and I went there last time to get all his bandages for pranking his wife when he fell down the stairs, they had a bunch of items. I'm going to CVS. Hey. How's what, it what's, going? What's, it's going terrible, Rebecca. What's going terrible? I can't lie to my best friend. This is all wrong. See? You can't lie to your best friend, Maddie. Any luck lying to Rick Noah? No, it's not working. So, you guys, I have an idea so that we don't have to lie to Rick Noah, but we can still get him over here, okay? Yes, yes. What if we surprise Rick Noah for his birthday? Oh. Oh, like what kind of surprise? Well, Ooh. what does Rick Noah love? Tall stalks of asparagus. The color green. Green ball pit balls. Skateboarding. Oh, yeah. And okay. also anything by the Jolly Green Giant. Okay, what the beans? Stock, you know, stuff like that. Too. What else for his birthday does he love? Trampolines? Disneyland! And what is closed right now? Disneyland. So, what do you think we do? We're breaking into Disneyland. Yes, 24 hours overnight in Disneyland while it's closed. We can go on all the rides and not have to wait in line. Yeah, I've always wanted to do this, Rebecca. There's so many rides. Okay, no, 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 no,
there. Yeah, he will, and you're gonna have to reveal this secret. No way. All right, Maddie, let's get this real quick. Buzz and Woody, Baskin Robbins ice cream cake. This is gonna be the best. Oh, he'll love it. Yep. All right, we have the cake for Rick Noah's surprise party. Wait a second. Yep, yeah, Rick Noah? No way. Rick Noah? No way. He's going into a store. What is he doing in there? I don't know, but I don't think he saw us. Wait a second, but he's here, so that means you have to tell me the secret you're announcing. Okay, okay, Maddie, come on, come on. No way. I know. No. It's so big. <laughs> okay, amazing. yeah, let's get back to the house, okay? okay. But no, I can't see us. Oh, he's coming out. He's coming out. No, no. Thank you so much, Danny, for coming at such short notice. Of course. So you think you're going to be able to turn my house into Disneyland? Disneyland. It's yeah. going to be a lot of work. It is, but if anyone can do it, you can do it. It's going to be magical. Yeah, and by the way, Matt told me that you helped him with the 10,000 roses. I did. Zanfam, go back and watch that video and comment below. I saw Danny when you seen it, so I know you came from this video and watched when Matt surprised me with 10,000 roses. That was so special, so thank you so much. You guys are awesome. Now I know you have a lot of setting up to do. Back to work. Remember, it's a surprise. Imagine Magical surprise, yeah. Disneyland is getting set up downstairs. I am so excited for you guys to see it, and I'm excited for Rick Noah. I know they wanted to lie to him, but I think this idea is so much better. Comment below, I love Disneyland. If you agree with me that telling the truth is the right thing to do. Wait a sec, Rick Noah's here. What's Rick Noah doing here? Oh no, I have to stop him. He cannot come in and see what is happening. <gasps> hey, Rebecca. Hey, Rick Noah, what are you doing here? I thought you were mad at us. I am kind of mad, but I wanted to bring Matt a get well soon package. He said he wasn't feeling well. Oh. Yeah, can I go drop no, this No, 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 no. Are you sure? No, uh, it's contagious. I mean, I'm immune to it because I'm his wife, but actually, though, he should be feeling better tomorrow. Oh, okay. I talked to his mom and said that he'd like all this stuff in here. I just couldn't find the music or the chicken noodle soup, but are you sure I can't just go give it to him? I feel really bad. No, no, this is perfect, but you know what? He would love to see you tomorrow. Really? Yeah. Say 11 a.m. sharp. That's pretty specific, but yeah. so 24 hours then. Yeah, yeah, exactly, 24 hours. All right, then. Well, make sure he's feeling all right, Rebecca. Okay, and you'll be back at 11. I'll be here. Or he might get sick again. Oh, I'll be here on time. We're counting on you. All right, thanks, Rebecca. Bye. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I got to see Matt and Maddie. Oh, that was close. What is he doing here? How did he beat us back from the store? Okay, well, he was dropping off a care package because you are sick. He's mad at us, and he still dropped off this care package for you. Plus, he called your mom to find your favorite items. He even got you a Twinkie. I love Twinkies. Okay, how are we going to get him back here on Saturday? I already took care of it. He is going to be coming back here, so we need to make sure everything is set up, you guys. Make sure that you are subscribed to the Rebecca Zamolo channel because on Saturday, Rick Noah is coming here, and we are throwing the biggest surprise. Surprise for him and turning our house into Disneyland. What? Make sure you are subscribed and also click this video right here. This is an awesome video that I love so much. Go watch that and then comment that you came from this video.